if I get this, I would be so excited because this would be my very first birdie and this is my birthday golf trip. I just need to calm down. This is going left to right. Welcome back to another episode of Sticks and Halos Golf. Nick and I are here at Monarch Beach Golf Links. Um, we are here to celebrate my birthday and we've never played here before, so hopefully we do well. Um, it's a Lynx course, so it's gonna be quite tough, but we are gonna do our best. It's gonna be fast, but buckle up, here we go. So we are doing hole number three. This is supposed to be one of their prettier holes because you can see the ocean. Check this out. This is the money shot right here. This is what you pay the big bucks for. Monarch Beach, Southern California. This is why our rent is so damn high. <laughs> I'm just gonna use a little seven here, try and get it out there. This is really about the second shot. <sighs> Come back. Come back. All right. Okay. All right. You're good. Perfect. All right. I'm gonna use a seven here too. Nice. I am happy with that. All right, let's go. All right, we did pretty good. We're all kind of like in the middle of the fairway. God, I mean, just check out this view. This is crazy. Sometimes, because we live here, we forget like how lucky we are to live here and just all the courses we get to play and stuff. It's expensive, but <laughs> we can play it sometimes. It's worth it, yeah. <laughs> So I'm going to use my seven again. I'm going to aim a little bit to the left. I'm going to try and hit it over these bunkers. Just hopefully I hit it pretty good. Oh, <laughs> no, I didn't hit it pretty good at all. Nick, yours is actually really good. Yeah. Really, really good. I actually got a little bit of a, got a nice roll. Yeah, but you have like a nice view of the green from where your ball's at. Just use a nice little wedge to try and get up there. Nice. Sit down. Sit down. Ooh, stop. Just sit. Nice. Good well, shot. I'm on the green. Oh my gosh. This is kind of weird. I hate when I do this to myself. Ugh, ugly, but I think I have a better view of the green from over there. All right, sit down into it. Okay, finally, I do something decent. My God, this game like makes me so frustrated sometimes. This is a pretty shot. I'm just gonna try and get it close to the hole as possible. Oh, I was hoping that it would curve back this way, but it didn't. A little right to left. Greens are fast, so. Really? No break? Nothing. It is what it is. Get up there. Ooh. 
Make that part, Nick. Nice. That's a party. Hole in one time. All right, Nick, 153 yards, hole in one. Oh, and the bunker. bunker on the left. Uh, we'll get it together. This is such a pretty course, but it is so hard. I think I've only played like one other Lynx course and the, God, the ball just shoots out every single time. It just runs out. So you got to make sure you're aiming correctly and your distances are right because otherwise it will just roll off the fairway, the green, everything. But I'm having a good time. All right, I just got to relax, calm down, just slow it down. Okay, left of the green, it's not on the green, and I missed the bunker, so we're safe, we're good. I was so glad I didn't say anything before <laughs> you swing because I was gonna say, babe, if you're gonna miss, miss left because there's water on the right-hand side. But I've been really trying to be patient and just let you kind of work through whatever your pre-game shot selection is and everything. And so I'm glad I didn't say anything because you actually missed left and you got a great shot. Yeah. I will take it. <laughs> Nice out. Ooh, slow, slow down. down. Sit, 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 slow sit. Slow down, slow down. My goodness. <laughs> the greens are crazy. The way that Nick's ball just like literally glided all the way through it, I think I'm just gonna putt mine. Like it's gonna be a crazy putt, but I don't know. Let's just try it. Oh my God, I didn't even hit it hard enough. It just, ugh. All right, I'm gonna try this again. My goodness. These greens are so tough. Okay, what are we doing here? This is, I don't know, left to right. I'm gonna try and just go straight to the cup, but on the left side. Nope, short. These greens are so slick that I'm like afraid to hit it. All right, double bogey. It's still a good day. I feel like this is breaking. Right to left. Okay, let's go. Tap it in or pick it up. All right. Beautiful course. The experience that we're getting, the ambiance, all of that stuff is great. But you come out here to enjoy the day. You don't <laughs> rush. Score is not important. It's uh, spending time with family. Score is not important. When you get on a course like this, <laughs> you gotta be very, very forgiving with yourself. <laughs> you ain't gonna ask me what I shot for the rest of the day. You ain't gonna ask me. No, we keeping score. I just said it's not important. <laughs> yeah, it's not important. Okay, so we are at hole number seven. This is the number one handicap hole of this course. If we learned anything from Mexico, do not judge why a hole is the number one handicap. So I am expecting to fail miserably, but I will do my best. We'll find out why it's the number one <laughs> handicap in just a second. Hold on tight. Hole number seven, here we go. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, let's go. Had a look. Looks like it stayed in. I mean, it's on the left hand side. All right. I think we got it. I think we good. I am trying to aim more right. I think I do not want to get over there and get into some trouble over there. That was so bad. Okay, I move forward. That's all I wanted. I actually don't even know what's over there, but that was, I think that was a good shot. It felt nice, sounded nice. So hopefully it landed nice too. What the, where the heck am I? Are we taking a draw? No. No? <laughs> <laughs> I got my hat too. Crap! That was a great drive. Holy crap. Well, I'm taking a drop because I cannot find my ball. Just let that roll out and then hopefully I have a shot over. Cool. I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna try and just hit it straight and get myself a better look at the green. That's why this is the number one handicap. handicap. Yeah. It's like I want to hit it so bad. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I'm in my head. I feel like I want to use a eight iron. Cause it's a little uphill. By that tree. By that tree. All right. So even though that was a really bad shot, thank goodness I didn't go into this. And actually, hopefully this makes means that I can get over. I think I am right by Nick. We are together by the tree. So yeah, this is tough and Nick lost the ball. It took me a thousand tries just to even get it over <laughs> um, whatever. I might have lost my ball. So when they say a hole is the number one rated handicap on a course, I would just believe them. Yeah. I would just say, you know what, this is gonna be a hard hole. And if you do well or walk away with a, a par or a bogey, did pretty damn good. I lost my ball for sure. I mean, it's probably in here somewhere. We will see, we will see, we will see. I think it's gone. I think it's gone. And just like that, both mine and Nick's balls are gone. So this hole is a bust for me. I know Nick is gonna drop, but I am moving on to the next. Five, six, seven. So I'm hitting seven. You know Nick is frustrated when he's quiet because usually he's pretty talkative. But when he's quiet, it means he's frustrated. So you gotta give him a space. He's in his head. Look. Mm, mm, mm. 
a lot of work for a snowman. A lot of work for a snowman. Oh my God, there's a snake. Get out of here. Oh. oh my God. Oh, I don't like snakes. It's a rattlesnake too. This hole didn't want us to be great. No. Mm -hmm. And there were snakes on this hole. I've <laughs> never seen a snake on a hole. All right, cute little part three. Over some water. Time to get busy holding one. Six. Six. Beautiful. On the green. Let's go. All right. It seems like this would be an easy hole, but I always somehow kind of mess it up. So let's just hope, <laughs> cross my fingers, the water is not there and I get it on the green. Gosh, the practice swings always sound good. And then... Yeah! Ooh! Is this my birdie hole? <laughs> oh, okay. Baby, I thought that was a hole in one hole. That was so <laughs> tracking for the pan. I was like, oh, she's gonna lose her mind right now. Beautiful oh my shot. god, we would have all lost our minds if I, <laughs> that was like the one good thing I did today if I was a hole in one. Ooh. But even if it's a par, I, I will take it. Check this out, isn't this so pretty? I'm probably not very close at all and of course, it's a really weird lie, so I wish I was right next to it. Go in, go in. Slow down. Nice fire. All right. If I get this, I would be so excited because this would be my very first birdie and this is my birthday golf trip. I just need to calm down. This is going left to right. Ugh, it didn't even break. <laughs> At least I didn't miss it short. Oh my God. Dang, it was a bogey. Oh my God, I suck. Anyways, whatever. <laughs> I'm sure I'll get another opportunity again to finally get my par, but I don't know. Do you think I was lined up wrong? Like, what could I have done? I just want my birdie already. You just went up, hit a great shot. Beautiful. I mean, you were on the green and won, so. A lot, a lot of good you can take away from that. Just not a, not a birdie. Just <laughs> well, you not can't a birdie. take a birdie away from that. <laughs> so we are almost done playing our 18 holes here at Monarch Beach Golf Links. And um, today was, was challenging. Today was pretty tough. I did not play very well. You guys can definitely see from the holes that we filmed. I don't even think I got a par, let alone a bogey today, but it's all good. I just came out here to have a good time. I think next time we come out here, I want to do a little bit more homework on the course because it's tough. The first three holes were beautiful. It had ocean views and it was like closer to the water. Back nine, you're a little bit more in the residential area. Still very pretty, but there are a lot of houses. You do have to be pretty accurate with your shots. But overall, I really enjoyed it. And on top of that, there's like monarch butterflies flying everywhere, which is so pretty. I've been trying to like capture them, but every time I see them, I don't have my camera out. Hopefully I'll catch some to show you guys. Otherwise, if you do come out to Monarch, Beach golf links. It is beautiful, but it's challenging. It's very challenging. All right, this is the last hole, hole 18. I'm just gonna film whatever we can, just so you guys can see it. Oh. 
I saw it and then I lost it. How'd that feel? <laughs> last, last drive felt good. <laughs> felt good. Yeah, but you never know. I will say this about this course. A lot of your tee offs and a lot of your shots are blind. So you really got to kind of keep an eye and the, the people that you're playing with have to keep an eye on where your ball went because it can get lost real quick. You're hitting a lot of blind spots. Oh, it's in the bunker. No, good, good, I'll take it. I think I'm gonna hit a six and just try and get it over here. I'm trying to avoid this water as much as possible. I'm gonna hit it towards that tree. No, no. Please don't be in the water. Please don't be in the water. Ugh. I hope I'm not in the water. Uh, yeah. I'm in the water, I, I bet. don't know, I don't know. I mean, it rolled down, but it looks like that red stick is kind of far off there. Yes, I didn't get in the water. <laughs> oh, but don't you worry. I might be in the water in a second because I got to hit over it. <laughs> Crap. I'm going to take the safe route and go this way. I don't know. What does the yardage say on the thing? 89 yards. <laughs> Freaking out for no reason. I grabbed a seven too. I'm freaking out. I'll get a nine. Oh my gosh, I'm freaking out. Rachel, it's just water. You're gonna get over. This is no problem. <laughs> Let's do that again. I'm in the water. And happy birthday to me. <laughs> That's the end. Good, so Let it roll good. Out. Roll. I don't even care. I'm on the green in two. Get that birdie. <laughs> <laughs> it's par four. He's on in two. One more. He's going to get that birdie. Glass hole, just like Mexico. Get that birdie. Let's get that birdie. This is a tough putt. Yeah, it is. This is a tough one. There's a lot going on here. <laughs> Yikes. Go. Go. It's a bogey. Can't be mad at today. Cannot be mad at today. I mean, that front nine was really tough. We had to get adjusted to the greens and just the way the course was playing. But on the back nine, I put together four pars in a row. And I think I, I salvaged the back nine. So that is another episode of Sticks and Halos Golf. Thank you so much for watching. And if you guys ever come out here, let us know what you guys think. And maybe you guys can give us some tips on how to play this course a whole lot better. Thank you again. And we will see you next time. Bye.